doesn't love music? What's more, who doesn't love seeing their favorite genre of music perform live on a stage? Um, whether you're in a coffee shop or a stadium, there's really a magical feeling about it uh, that really fills the soul. Me, personally, I love live music. If you ever go to a show with me, I'll be smiling ear to ear the entire time. Over the last two years, I've learned that live music can do more than just help me as an individual. It can help my community as well. I want to start off by talking about uh, two successful music festivals that happen every year in Guelph. The first one is the Gain Music Festival. Gain actually stands for the Guelph and Area Independent and New Music. Uh, they book uh, shows year-round in Guelph, uh, putting lo local bands in local venues. And once a year, they have a huge festival that fills all three floors of Van Gogh's ear. Uh, there's between 10 and 15 bands for an awesome night of live music. If you haven't gone, I really recommend it. Another festival that happens in Guelph uh, that you might have heard of is Kazoo Fest. Uh, Kazoo Fest is a let me get this right, <laughs> uh, multi-day, multi-location, multi-platform festival that features 30 acts from all over and it really helps put Guelph on the map as a musical hotbed. So I've heard a lot of artists say that Guelph has a unique music scene and I'm not sure exactly why that is but I would tend to agree. Uh, we've got a huge number of really awesome, amazing artists that live in Guelph and we also attract a lot of bands through town that wouldn't normally stop in a city this size. So why does this matter? Why should we care about live music as a community? Well, if you look at the examples I just mentioned, you'll start to see some things that are really important. First off, music helps foster a sense of community. Um, if you've ever been to Hillside Festival, you know what I'm talking about. There's an amazing community that, that happens at Hillside every year, and people behave in a way that they wouldn't normally behave in in their everyday life. Uh, Hillside really brings out the hippie in everyone. And that doesn't mean that you have to go swimming in Guelph Lake or wear crazy clothes. What it really means is that that sense of community is acting with compassion and sharing and love. And that's all generated by a shared interest in live music. And while Hillside is really a magical place, um, I think there's a lot that we can learn from the events that take place there and apply it to our everyday life, looking at live music as that connector. Beyond building a community, uh, local music also attracts new people to our city. That can come in the form of new talent, um, new business opportunities. There's a lot out there. And I think a great example to look at is Austin, Texas. Austin in the 1970s realized that they were a lot like Guelph, they had a unique music scene. Some people got together and formed the Austin Music Foundation, which provided resources for new musicians that were just starting out, but also provided benchmarks uh, for venues to make sure that artists got paid fairly. As a result, a lot of new musicians that were just starting out flocked to Austin, but it wasn't just them. Um, music fans came to reap the benefits of the awesome live music scene that existed there. And as a result, Austin now has a booming tech industry, uh, one of the best in North America. So what can we learn from this? What can Guelph, can Guelph take a page from Austin's book? I think so. Um, we're already seen as a very forward thinking community, which is awesome. Um, what if we applied some of the same principles and boosted more industry and innovation in our town as well? More than anything else though, music just makes you happy. If you ever go out to a live show, you're hanging out with your friends, you're having a lot of fun. And when you have a lot of people that are happy in a community, it makes for a really productive community. A great example of how music can make you happy um, happened this summer. Ian Finley, uh, city councillor, put a piano out in front of his uh, office on Baker Street and encouraged people to stop and play. Uh, soon after, a call went out for more pianos and there was eight different pianos uh, down to, located downtown Guelph where anyone could just stop and play. It was called the Making Happy, Making Happy Campaign. It was a huge success. Um, people were just stopping and playing and there was groups of people. You could hear people singing at like all hours of the day. It was really awesome. I think it's a great example of showing how um, music can inspire people and build a, strength and a strengthening community by making people happy. Just to quickly summarize, I think it's really easy to see how a vibrant live music scene can have long-term benefits for the city of Guelph. Whether you're looking to uh, attract new talent to the city, build a stronger community, um, inspire the local residents, or even just go out and enjoy a show, 
Um, there's music that's happening almost every night of the week in this city, and a whole different wide array of genres. I really encourage you to get out, go see a live show, and support our local music scene. Local music scene. Thank you.